Hi, I'm Nana Girl and I want to be a superhero! And this week, the superpower that I am working on is the power of flight. So, let's start with the obvious. I want to fly, I need to work out how things fly. And then, try to do what they do. Maybe flap my wings. Makes sense, right? So what's something that can fly? Hmm, I've got it. Aeroplanes. They fly, usually, unless they've crashed but let's not include those ones. Okay, I'm gonna work out how an aeroplane can fly and then maybe we can work out how we can all fly and you can fly and I can fly and it'll be awesome. We're gonna to need to think about forces. So there are four forces involved in flight and they are gravity, thrust, drag and lift. Now planes and birds, they don't fly backwards so there must be a force that moves them in the right direction, forwards, and that is thrust and it creates a pushing force that moves a flying thing forwards. Now, aeroplanes generate thrust with their engines and their propellers, which push the air backwards and help keep the plane moving forwards. So today, we're gonna test this theory by building a paper plane that gets its thrust and its power, not from an engine, but from an elastic band. For this experiment, you will need scissors, tape, a paper clip, a large elastic band or a hair elastic, a sheet of thin card, some plain paper, a ruler, and a pencil. Start by measuring and drawing a rectangle on your piece of paper that's 16 centimeters long and eight centimeters wide. Then cut it out. Fold it in half to make it narrower, and then in half again. Now measure about three centimeters from one end. Then fold your paper back at that point and you'll make a hook. Place your elastic band into that hook and then tape it so that it's sealed in there. This is gonna be our launch mechanism and well, basically we're making a catapult. Next, we've got to make the plane shape. So put the catapult to one side for now and take your piece of card. You want to draw a triangle on your piece of card where each side of the triangle should be the same with a length of about 12 centimeters. Now a triangle that has all of the sides the same is called an equilateral triangle. Quite like that word, equilateral. Next, we've got to think about the weight of this plane and how it will balance in the air. I found that if you put a paper clip on one corner of the triangle, it will fly much better. And that's because the center of gravity is at the paper clip point. Now, if you don't have a paper clip, try some blue tech. Okay, now finally, you're gonna tape this bit with your catapult end at the front to the underside of your plane with a little bit of tape. That's it, now you're ready to launch. Hook your thumb into the elastic band and pull the plane backwards by the other end of the catapult. When we stretch the elastic band backwards, we create tension and when we let go, the elastic force will create enough thrust to launch the plane forwards. Okay, ready? Ow. Yep, that definitely flies. Now, to test its flying accuracy, you might want to make some skittles by taking some tape and rolling some sheets of paper up and you can add some points to this. I'm just gonna set this up here and see if you can find some other friends who want to compete with you. Watch this. You'll stand at one end and see whether you can knock them all over. Ready? Ha ha ha! 100 million points for me! Okay, that's enough accuracy testing. Now, what I've done is actually made some different ones that are bigger and smaller, and it's time for the moment of truth. Will this catapult plane give me the power of flight? Let's test it with a little nano girl that I call Nano Nano Girl. This is me, basically. Hi. Okay. So we're gonna attach her to this slightly bigger plane with a little bit of plasticine. And well, it's time to do the first prototype, the power of thrust. Three, two, one. Oh, that was a wall. Power of thrust, tick. Power of brakes, not so much. I don't think I'll be building a full-size catapult for myself anytime soon, but let's try again tomorrow. Okay, Nana Girl, away! Oh yeah, haven't invented a flight yet. Don't worry. Nano girl, away!